Hi everybody, here we are again and it's rapidly approaching the time of year for some dog torture. It's not as bad as it sounds. Pirate Mania is coming up and it's a bit of a tradition that the dogs have a costume. I'm looking at the dogs over there. Should be looking at you. Got a beer. So this year they're going to go as pirates carrying bombs. It's the sort of thing that pirates carry. They've been treasure chests, they've been barrels. Uh, so what you need is some balloons, some old newspaper, a bit like Blue Peter, some wallpaper paste. Now I've mixed it up, I think I mixed it up a bit thick really, but it wants to be a bit fairly strong because you're making papier mache on the balloon. Right, so blow the balloon up. <coughs> it needs to be the size of the dog, well, not the size of the dog, the size of the dog's body. It's the length of the body between the two legs. So it needs to be, what, five inches? Right. Try that one again. I don't know if you can see that, I'm hoping you can see that. Doing it over there because she doesn't like balloons, as I've already said. So that will probably do. It'd be better if it was rounder, but put little dog down. She's going to have a nervous breakdown. <coughs> Told you. <coughs> Bell, shut up. Right, that's not too bad for being round. I'll fast forward. Rip the rough it. newspaper roughly into strips, about an inch thick. Doesn't matter if it's not. Doesn't matter if it turns off like that one did. Rough, rough strips. You get the idea. Get a pot noodle tub. Chicken and mushroom, best one in my book. And that is just to sit the balloon on. You don't need to go all the way to the bottom with the paper. Wallpaper paste. This does get a little bit messy. This bit I will fast forward. Once you've got most of it covered, you can start using chunks. It's good to mix it up a little bit. Try to put the paper in different directions because it makes it stronger. Because paper does have a grain to it. And I'll stop filming there. Basically, you need to build it up, several layers of paper, and then let it dry. We'll get back to you. Right, hi everybody, we're back again, a couple of days later, and you'll find that you've got quite a hard ball shape. So, first of all, we need to let the air out of it. It won't pop as such because the papi mashi holds it together. Right, you need to get a little dog. Come here. Oh. Now, we'll try and get her to stand up for this. Stand, good girl. Wait. Right, so we need to draw rough shape on it. Uh, right there. Just gauging. Good. 
come going at the bottom but not entirely come, come close it. Only very rough, it's just give you a bit of a guide. Put little dog down for the minute. And then cut, cut way on the inside of the line. So this is the bit that we're getting rid of. So you want to cut inside the line. Cut it out, try it on the dog, and cut it out and trim it until eventually you get the one that fits. you do the edges probably paint at least a bit of the inside if not all of it just because it'll waterproof it to some degree hi everybody here we are final stages of the dog costume we've got it painted black got some natural twine rope stuff it's the stuff that goes on cat scratching posts just natural twine, I, I should remember what it is. I've, in the middle of it, because I'm using two pieces, I've just put PVA, let it soak in. The middle's gone stiff, that means it won't fray. So, roughly, in half. Maybe. Probably not with a pair of scissors. Sharp knife. It just, the PVA just stops it fraying at the end. The ends were frayed, I PVA'd them, it stopped them from fraying. So it's decide, decision time now as to which end to use. probably have that to the outside right so with a reasonably sharp implement I'm going to use the leather drill on the Swiss Army knife just at the top making a hole Only made a small hole. Probably use the small blade. On both sides. Open it up a bit. Put the end through as such. Hot glue gun on the inside, just go around the string that you just put in, gluing it into the costume. Now a bit of artisticness. Not sure how good this is going to be.
Then, some cotton wool. Alright, what I don't think. Using the PVA, we're just going to glue that on. That would probably do. Right, so what you need now is a willing subject. Yeah. A little bit damp, we've been out in the rain. It has deformed slightly, but it's, it's not too bad. Put it on that way, I think. So, as you can see, I think what I might do is put PVA on the string just to stiffen it up. Make it sit upright like that. Probably put a bit more red. <coughs> on there like that. <coughs> I can see what you're thinking. That just looks like a fat dog. Well, so there we go. That's the costume. Two pirates, if you use a little bit of imagination, carrying a bomb. Um, as I say, I'm going to make that a few stiff so it's up. Uh, but yeah, the obviously it's just a pair of roughly made trousers with a shirt and some arms, a teddy for the back. with the same cutaway at the back for emergency poofy purposes. Right, so like, comment, subscribe and I'll just see if I'm in action.